Hello, this is Herbert A. Brown, Jr., Focus Winner. Today's message is, you were chosen by God. 1 Peter 2.9 But you are not like that, for you are a chosen people. You are a royal priest, a holy nation, God's very own possession. As a result, you can show the goodness of God to others, for you are called out of the darkness into his wonderful light. Deuteronomy 14.2 You have been set apart as holy by the Lord your God. You were chosen out of all the nations of the earth to be his special treasure. John 15.16 You didn't choose me. I chose you. I appointed you to produce lasting fruit so that the Father will give you whatever you ask for using my name. Romans 9, 11 through 12. Before they were born, before they had done anything good or bad, she received the message from God. And this message shows that God chooses people according to his own purposes. He calls people, but not according to their good or bad works. She was told, your older son will serve your younger son. Romans 12, 4 through 5. Just as our body has many parts, and each part has a special function, so it is with Christ's body. We are many parts of one body, and we all belong to each other. Again, today's message is, you were chosen by God. Now, many of you need encouragement. You have any financial difficulties? You have any family problems? You have any difficulties in the workforce? But what you have to do is stay encouraged and realize that God chose you before you were even in your mom's womb. God chose you. He knows all your flaws. You are no surprise to God. He knows every flaw that you have. He knows every mistake that you made, and he knows every mistake that you will make. But he loves you. He chose you for a reason, to make a positive impact on this life. Be encouraged. Know that God chose you, you and only you, to do and make the impact on this earth that only you can make.